All right, this is gonna be a short video. Be a short video. Minimal editing, hopefully. Um, hi. How are you guys? I'm alive. Sorry for like a week plus of no uploads or live streams. That's my bad. Sorry. Uh, been touched with Plagal's... Uh, Plagal's. <laughs> Nurgle's Plague. I'm fucked up, as you can tell. Uh, this is the best I felt. <coughs> Believe it or not, that was not planned. But, uh, this is the best I felt in over a week. Thankfully, I seem to be on the mend. Uh, so I just wanted to make a quick video, uh, letting you all know I'm alive. You know, I'm alive. I'm doing good. Well, I'm not doing good. I'm, I'm hopefully going to be soon doing good, and Nurgle's rot will leave my body, and I can be back, ready to go, slamming into things, doing Warhammer content, and having fun. That being said, while I was gone, some dumb shit happened. Now, I'm not going to cover all of it in this video, because there's one thing I think deserves a dedicated video, and that is the new retcons with the end of the Horus Heresy series, and the battle between Horus and the Emperor. Um, be on the lookout for that video. I don't know if I'm going to do it in this commentary style. Probably not. I, I want a dedicated breakdown of the of what it is. So, I'll probably do a, a more edited, more stylistic, maybe. It might be the wrong word, but I'll go with that uh, video on that. So, be on the lookout for that. I'm not going to even do that, though, till I'm fully recovered, because I don't want to have to edit around all the coughing and the nasally sounding stuff and basically I want to be a hundred percent for when I make that video so be on the lookout for it and then there's gonna be an open mic on the same topic after I make a video on it so uh, anyway that aside other drama did happen I'm not going into too much detail again this is gonna be a short video and I'm actually mean that this time so some stuff happened in the chud hammer community where for some reason there was a huge blow-up between two prominent members. Actually, I think it was more than two at this point. It started out with just two, and then it, like, ballooned into, like, dozens of people. But, uh, yeah, it was all over Primaris. Because. <laughs> like, it started, like, for, for me, like, I, I asked about, like, what the situation was, and the breakdown sounded absurd. Like, it started out with two perfectly... Reasonable gentlemen, well, as reasonable as, you know, internet pe folks can be, especially in, in the, this community, can be. And then it ballooned from, I like Primaris, I don't like Primaris, to bannings, mutings, fuck off, you know, die, unfollow, unfollow, unfollow. Turned into this whole huge thing. And I'm not even going to say the names of the people involved, because it's, for, for me, I just want to leave it at this. Why? Like, seriously, what? I, I don't understand how a disagreement of Primaris turned into all that shit. Like, it was ridiculous. But anyway, that shit happens. And then for the actual title of this video, I'm gonna leave, I, I Honestly, though, I didn't. I don't want to make anything too big out of this. I'm just gonna say this. West Hammer v. Major Kill. Why? Just, the thing is, I will say this, it's not even a versus situation. It's Major Kill being an, e an egotistical narcissist, thinking he owns Warhammer lore, apparently, throws, like, the baton at West Hammer, of all people. I'm assuming because of the jealousy that West Hammer blew the fuck up, but, I don't know. And then he takes down his video because his own audience, rightfully so, told him, Dude, you fuckwad. You don't own this shit. <laughs> he takes down the video. He then puts a community post up. Alright, so quick, like, edit mid-video. Because, um, uh, I haven't checked this community post since just for the editing part of this video in a while. And apparently he added an edited section. And I actually want to give... Major kill some credit. Uh, I do. I do actually want to give him some very notable credit here. And um, I'm not going to lie. Like, in my the rest of the recorded segment, which is now going to be cut out of this video, I was pretty harsh on Major Kill for all this. And really, like, mocked his ego a little bit. But honestly, like, this right here, this shows a lot more maturity and 
gives me a little bit more respect than I displayed in that. So I no longer feel how I did at the end of it. Not entirely, anyway. So I want to I wanna highlight this. But this was the community post in question that I was referring to. And in this edited section, he says, Coming back to my computer at the end of the day of cooling off and reflecting and yeep. Uh, yep, uh, I don't know what yeep about. Uh, I get it. I get it. Uh, or yep, I get it. My ego got the better of me, and I publicly lashed out at something that annoyed me because I thought I could. This isn't the major kill I wanted to bring into 2024, but it has been good to reflect on what I actually want to achieve, be, and create, and, and that is, engaging lore videos, Smexy cosplay. Get this sh get this shit off me! Get this fucking, get this fucking, get this shit off me! Should I, like, clip this to my balls? Okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna say anything. Hectic dioramas, soon trademark, and the boatload of uh, Battle Mace 40 million artworks. Got to move forward with this as good as a good lesson about managing my hubris and ego. That's the part that I, I respect. Like, he, he's outright admitting it was hubris and ego. Not a lot of people are man enough to do that. So, major kill to you. Mad respect for that. Honestly. Like, that's... that That is a quality that people don't have these days. In any form. Now, people might say, well, he didn't make a video, and he didn't say this verbally. He did it through text. Honestly, like, still, these days, even in even in text, even in this kind of form, people don't seem to have the gumption to admit when they fuck up, when they pull a bad move, and when they have a bad perspective. It's so rare these days that even in this form, I'm willing to give him some credit. So, at a major kill, mad respect for that, is admitting that it was hubris and ego that got to you, and not trying to deflect. Now, granted... I think it's fair to say that, uh, fair to point out, would you be saying this if you didn't get the backlash that you did? But, at the end of the day, you did admit it was Hugo, uh, so Hugo, you did admit it was hubris and ego, not a lot of people can do that, even if there was social pressure to do so, but you still did it. So, respect to you, well done, and, uh, yeah, just wanted to throw that out there. Oh yeah, and also the last part is pretty important. Original statement remains unedited as to try as to not try and manipulate the narrative about what I said and how I was feeling. That again also should be should take notable respect. So good on you. So yeah, that's my thoughts on it. I know, I know, a little bit clickbaity. I apologize, but again, I, this is the video is more about you know saying hey, I'm alive, I'm not dead, and I'm coming back and working on stuff. And yeah, but those two dramas happened while I was sick, and they're both stupid. They're both extremely stupid. But they're also both seemingly over and done with, so... I guess that's the end of the video. See, I made it short this time. I actually I actually made it short this time. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good one, everybody. And yes, I'm alive. Bye-bye!